Hi, my name is Mara Ruby, and you're watching Billboard. Cry me a river. Cry me a river. I cried a river over you. Tell me kind of when and how you were first introduced to music. When my mother was pregnant, my father used to put headphones on really? my mom's stomach and play a lot of his favorite music, my mom's favorite music. And I, I still have a hard time believing it, but they swear up and down that I would kick or move in the rhythm of the music. Do you know what he would play? He played a lot of Bill Withers, Coltrane, Billie Holiday. When did you have that aha moment that this is what you wanted to do as a career? The summer after I graduated high school, 2006. You remember? <laughs> I definitely remember because I was really embarrassed and shy about my voice, so I didn't tell anybody that I liked to sing. My best friend didn't even know until the summer after high school. I was in the car with her. She was going to UCLA. With her and her brother, they were both in the car, and I told them, you know, I think I want to try singing. <laughs> and they kind of laughed, but they were curious at the same time, so they asked me to sing. And I, I sang a song in the car, and I remember the feeling, like I was mortified and nervous. I thought I was going to die. It was just But you were with, friend, with family and friends? I hadn't told anybody, not even my own family. My best friend was like, oh my god, Mari, you could sing. I had no idea. Why didn't you tell me? It was, this emotional moment and I just, that summer, I spent really honing the idea of songwriting. Cry me a river. Archaic Rapture is a really emotional project for me. It's six songs. One of the songs is an original that my aunt wrote. The other five songs are jazz standards from the 40s, 50s era. And it was the best way for me to emotionally get through the biggest heartbreak and actually my only heartbreak that I've ever been through. I was with a guy who cheated on me with six women, which is why I'm doing six, six songs. songs. It's why I'm calling the project Archaic Rapture. It was my grieving process. It was the darkest point in my life. Yeah. So choosing the songs that I'm doing on this project was my way of coping with the reality. I cried a river. Cry Me River was the first song that I decided to do for this EP. When I saw V for Vendetta, mm -hmm. it was in that movie. And I absolutely, oh, I just fell in love with that song. It, it struck a chord in me that I'd never felt. And at that point when it came out, I didn't know I wanted to do music. <laughs> but I told myself, I'm going to do this song one day. I don't know why or how. I'm just going to do something. With so you didn't song. know you wanted to sing. I had no at clue. That time. No, it, it's just sometimes you get these yeah. feelings and you get passionate, you get these ideas. So when I got my heart broken for the first time, it the, the light bulb went off, and I just realized this is the perfect time to do that song. <laughs> Who are you in the face of disappointment? So tell me about character, which is the second song that you performed. Character is a song that is on my first and only EP, From Her Eyes, and it's a song that Van Hunt originally did. And it was a special song to me because I, I just have this soft spot for songs that have to do with struggle, with pain, with the conflict of choice of, if I were to go this direction, how is that defining my character? Let it out, let it go. So what happens after Archaic Rapture? After Archaic Rapture, I am immediately working on my original album. I want to say I'm 11, 12 songs in to what my original album is going to be, so I just need to get the finalized recordings in the studio and it'll be done. Maybe it's time you moved on. Who are you when heavy weather is blowing? 